Hey, I got your rent money. Oh, okay, you know you got a late fee. A late fee for what? You ten days late. Ten days? It ain't my fault. I'm ten days late. I get paid every other week. So how is it my fault that I'm late? My check don't fall on the first. So how I'm supposed to pay you on the first and I get paid every two weeks? That's not Do my you fault. You know how to be responsible. Responsible. Yes, if you. I'm get paying you rent. That's responsible. I'm giving your rent money every month. Yes, but. If you get paid every two weeks, you should take so much money out so you can pay your rent. I got other time. bills to pay other than just my rent. I got That's I, not my fault. I got furniture bill, That's I got not power bill, I got a water bill. That's not my I got fault. a car note. That, you know what? That's not my fault. You ten days late, you need to pay this late fee. Alright, just or all else. right, I got you. I'll give you a late fee. Hey. Hey, what's going on? For you to come to. Here's the rent money. Alright. Uh yeah, the gutter's messed up. It's uh, something up in the roof. I don't know how it got in there. A hole came, one of the hole got in the roof from that storm the other day. And it's by the attic and some animal or something in there. I hear it crawling around. And um, the gutters, like I said, need to be cleaned out because when it rained, it just shh, poured down. I mean, man. Why every time I come over here to get the rent, every month it never fails. You have something to complain about. Like, the only time you complain is when it's time for me to come get the rent. Like, this problem ain't happened before it's time for the rent to be due. Like, but you think you're supposed to get special privileges because you're paying me rent every time I come? It's something. Well, I'm just trying to get the house in good shape. That's Dude, what whatever. You can move out, okay? Because I'm tired of you anyway. Well, I'm month. moving out next week, and you better give me my deposit you back. You ain't getting no deposit back. Oh, man. What's this? Oh, hey. <laughs> hey, you said you need something fixed over here? Yeah, uh, fuse blown on the box downstairs. You don't know how to change a fuse? You're a whole man. You're a landlord, though. That's why I called you over here. Just like you time. called me over here a couple of days ago to change a light bulb. Yeah. Why are you calling me over here to do simple stuff like that you could do yourself? Maybe I like looking at my landlord. <laughs> uh, maybe uh, you could change and do stuff yourself next time, okay? Let's go look at this fuse box. Okay, but can we talk about something else? No, we can't. Really? Why not? But I want to... Yeah, I'm here to look at the toilet. Okay. Oh, uh, you got a dog now? No, that's uh my sister's. I'm just babysitting. Well, I just can't pick the rent up last month, and it's the same dog here. So you still babysitting? Yeah, she's uh, been sick. Well, just to let you know, it's a uh, fifty dollars extra a month for a dog. She's not here for a month. All right. Well, we're gonna see because the dog is still here. So I'm assuming it's your dog. So that's how you're going to do? Just assume? If the dog is still here next month, just know you're paying extra $50 a month. Okay? Okay, I'll make sure she come and pick her up. All right, let me take you to this. Thing. Oh, hey. Hi. Yeah, so the, you see the fences. Yeah, I seen it when I pulled up. Yeah, so that happened when the wind was blowing from the storm, and you see it's rusted a little bit, so it just broke off. Uh, so I don't know what you want to do about it. Uh, the fence wasn't even that bad. I got a picture of how the fence looked. It wasn't rusted. It wasn't nothing went wrong, but ain't no way the wind just messed the fence up like that. So what are you trying to say? Uh, that you did something to the fence. That wasn't due to the wind. No, the wind broke that. No, thing. it didn't. You need to just be honest and say what really happened. What makes you think I did something to it? Because of your picture? It's rained and stormed and wind been blowing and all of that since then. Look at all the branches that fell down. Like you. Okay, the fence is more stronger than branches on a tree. Well, I don't know what happened to it. I know I didn't do nothing. I know and the I'm wind, and I know, and I know the wind didn't do it. I'm not paying for it. Well, it's coming As out of your landlord. deposit. Well, you ain't got paid for it now, but when you move out, it's coming out of your deposit. That's also that's how it is. You just gonna take it. Yes, because you could clearly tell that somebody did something to that fence. That was not due to the wind. You could clearly tell that that is a lot of damage. 
the wind ain't gonna cause that much damage. I could see if we had a tornado come through here or something. We ain't had no tornado, no type of real bad storms. We had a little bit of rain, and you tell me the little wind that came through here from that rain we just had did that damage. Yes. Okay, well just know it's coming out of your deposit because you're I know you're lying. Whatever. Front door. Okay, landlord, you better get this right this time. I'm doing good. Oh, okay, come on. So did you um, get a guy for the electrical work? If not, I have a guy that can do it. Yeah, I talked to your guy. Oh, he called you already? Yeah, he called me. He called okay. me $400 for the job, which that's reasonable mm -hmm. or whatever. But the only problem I have is he want $300 up front before he do the job. And I don't know him like that. I don't pay for work up front before it's done because... There's a lot of people out here that just take your money and run. I don't know him like that, and I don't know what y'all got going on, but I'm not doing that. Why do you think I got something going on? Because it's your I guy. Just, I, I mean, I just know him from being around and doing a few jobs, but I don't know him like that. But, yeah, you're right, though. I wouldn't want to pay up front. But, okay, when is your guy going to come, though? Because I need this done. Yeah, I need you to reach out right now. Okay, I'm reaching out to him today, then I'll let you know. It might be a couple of weeks. I don't know. Just just be patient. Okay. It'll I need, get done. Okay. I wish I just would have got a gas stove anyway, but I need the electric stove working. So can Okay, as long please? as you got electricity and the house is good, okay, you could just be patient because I already told you to buy a different stove, but you refuse to buy a different stove. So now you got to wait for me to get a guy to come over here and hook your stove up for you. So that's not my problem. So okay. you just gonna have to wait. All right, whatever. Yeah. Now let's see why this tenant playing games. Okay, well, I came last night for the rent money, um, but you weren't. Well, here's your money water. Why tell your landlord to come pick up the rent and you know you're not home? There's rent money. You text me to come last night and I showed up. Your kids was here. Be quiet. Your, I know. You see. Your kids was here and you, they said that you was at work. Yes. Okay. Why I would work you? I worked second shift. Yes, I was at work. So why would you text me and say come to pick the rent up if you knew you was at work? Like I'm supposed to know her work schedule. Today, not last night. Why would you come last night? You know my work schedule. I'm supposed to know your work schedule. Uh, you text said come and get the rent. Correct. When you say come and get it, that means come to get it. That's up to you when you come and get it. I told you come and get it, which yeah. I thought you knew. I meant today, not last night. Right, whatever. You got That's not all that matters. It's the principle. 